Well, hey folks, this is Seven here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Rising World. Now, this time, this is actually the new edition. <laughs> yeah, there's. When you load the game, if you pick the uh, the new Unity version in your Steam properties, oh, it starts you in a house. Very nice. Um. It gives you your usual shortcut and all that, and it does say new version of the game. Ooh, can I pick these up? Apparently, oh, F maybe? Yes. Okay. But you can't actually launch it from the shortcut and have it come up with this. You have to launch it from your Steam library. Nice chest. There's not actually anything in it, but... Hmm. Really nice. Alright. Oh, here, we'll close it back up. And... So yeah, if you launch it from the shortcut that they give you, it actually puts you back into the... Um, There we go, let's empty our hands. It puts you back into the Java one. If you launch it from your Steam library, then it actually comes up... Oh, this just looks awesome. It'll actually come up with a little uh, pop-up window that asks if you want to play the new version or the old Java version. There seems to be, even though the frames are nice, like I'm getting about 70-ish to 80-ish, there's a bit of, yeah, it's, it's not dipping, it's the inconsistency. It's almost, whoa, <laughs> like I'd need to lock it on a certain point. Wow, they really uh, up to their game with mountains. Holy smokes. Now that is uh, mountain height. Whew, crazy. I guess without a tool, I can't do much. Now, unfortunately, the demo is kind of, well, this. It's just pretty much a walking simulator. Um, and it's to give an idea. I mean, look at how good that looks, though. The way the wind is blowing the grass. The sound is really nice. I know you guys probably can't hear it that well. I have turned it down a bit because it does tend to interfere a lot. But um, good sound. The music is really nice, but, well, obvious reasons why we aren't listening to that. Oh, my goodness. That is uh, that is quite the view. And I do apologize for... Uh, the other video and going on and on about how it was, you know, the new version and how well it was. It did seem to be playing much, much smoother, etc. than the last time I played it. But by the same token, it has been a while. I think there is probably a patch or two to the Java edition since the last time I played it. So here we are going down a mine. Oh, a pick. Yes. Oh, several picks. Yoink. Nice. Oh, we can actually break it up, eh? Nice. Now, it's not leaving anything for us to pick up, and I don't think... Okay, that's not inventory. Here we go. Yeah, it's not like it's putting it into our inventory. So we're not actually getting any rock or gravel or anything like that, but... Ooh. No, I can't break them and get into that. There we go. What's in it? 
<laughs> I can blow the light out. <laughs> All right, let's continue on here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Maybe we can sneak down in there and get that anyway. Look at that. Oh, what's in here? Apparently some kind of artifact or something. Hmm. Tea. Leave you all in the dark. Oh, well, here we go. What do we got going on here? Ooh, very fluid. Very fluid. Well, that's what we wanted. We're higher up now. Because, like, just in case we weren't high enough before. Very nice. Oh, yeah, I see. Okay. <laughs> we didn't go far, but we certainly did go up. Ooh, we're still pretty mountain goaty. That's cool. All right, I do like the way things sort of explode. Oh no! Oh, I didn't think I'd actually be able to do that. I'll be honest with you. Oh, now I feel bad. That was kind of oh. Nothing to see here. Move along. Ooh, oops. <laughs> Okay then, well now we know. Now I'm curious, is this... Uh... Well, I guess we won't know because it doesn't... Uh... Oh, that's quite the hole. <laughs> it doesn't tell us what there is, we don't get anything. No. No, unfortunately none of the stuff is actually interactable at this point. But you can kind of get an idea of, well, different things like that, how it breaks up. and I haven't found an axe yet. I wonder if I can knock a tree down with a pick, what do you think? Oh yeah, look at that. Bye. <laughs> yeah, what does that remind me of? Farm sim. That's what used to happen when you'd knock down trees on hills. Oh, there we go. And I believe it should be F to pick up logs. Alright, so I can at least pick up some logs. Did it drop any saplings or stuff? No, not like the old one. Okay. And... Oh. Oh, here they are. Piece of log. We got some stone. Oh, we did get some stone. Alright. Not freaking much, but... We got three pieces of stone. I would imagine that was from breaking this as opposed to the stuff in the cave. So let's just see. Do we have more than three pieces now? No goofy thing. I wonder if I got it from breaking up that lantern. Tee <laughs> hee. No, still nothing new. Okay. Okay, we've got a sprint. We might as well put that away. We don't need to walk around with it in our hands. And you can see the stamina bar, the green one there, slowly going down. Alright, well that's the end of this little trek. Or at least as far as the path goes. Now I haven't noticed anything like... Um, there was all the veggies growing and all that sort of thing. I haven't seen any of that yet. I think basically what they've done here is they're just giving us the basic new world. Because animal life seems, well, all things considered, pretty scarce. I thought that might have been a bird, but it's just a piece of fluff. Very close as opposed to a bird far away. <laughs> Hmm. I'm hoping we can run across some water here. Just so we get an idea of uh, how that all is a working out. There may not be any, I don't know. As I say, this is uh, 
seems, especially after all of this time, to be a fairly basic demo. You know. I mean, I don't know anything about programming this stuff, but... I would have thought after this period of time they would have been a little further along. I just heard a woodpecker. Almost out of stamina. Well, no water over this rise. <laughs> Let's continue down the hill. As I replenish my stamina. Wow, the shadows look good. As we get in this little bit of a valley out of the sun. A little bit of shine on the rocks, almost like they're wet, which is... I don't think something you'd really see a lot of in a, uh, a shadowed place. But I suppose you've got to make it stand out somehow from the grass, don't you? Get some color into it. Okay, I think it's going to be a long way down, isn't it? What do we got here? Oh, that's just a tree. I thought there was like a log, but there doesn't seem to be anything really out of place. It doesn't seem to be any water either. Let's just get up this way and have a little look. Yeah, I'm not seeing it. Oh! Alright, well, they've uh, put fall damage in. Hmm. <laughs> There's no bandages or anything, so we don't want that to happen too often, or this is, uh, gonna be a one-way trip. Which it probably is anyways. So, a little bit of a different biome here. A huge rock expanse. Uh, what do we got? Three? Oh, yeah. And we are getting stone now like crazy. Nice. At least we hollowed out quite a little chunk there, eh? Huh. Very neat. Um. Yeah, there's no... No, there's no journal, no crafting. None of that has been implemented. It is absolutely that. A walking simulator with a couple of mechanics built in. Like a few things you can break, I suppose. Be more accurate than mechanics built in, but... Yeah. So I guess there's probably... Uh... Oh, that still gave us stone. I thought maybe with the other material look upon it, it would be maybe copper or iron or something, but it doesn't appear to be. Um, I'm still hoping to run into water here. It's the only reason I'm continuing, to be honest with you. But we've either gone completely the wrong direction, or, as I say, that's not implemented yet. But I did want to bring you guys back. Um, as I said, apologize for kind of misleading you about what they had before. That was the old version of the game. Which, you know, yeah, I don't know. It had so much going for it. I guess they, they just ran into a wall with what Java could do compared to what they wanted to do. So, yeah. Because otherwise, it's really quite a shame that they didn't just carry on with it. There was so much there, and so much of it worked very, very well. But, and I think that may have been a part of it, is Java's just not that great with water. I mean, look how long Minecraft was around before they started even allowing you to go underwater. And it's an incredibly unrealistic <laughs> sort of a going underwater thing. It's just a change of colors and a little bubble that tells you you're actually running out of air. So, yeah, I think this is um, maybe even just an unfinished zone. So... That's, uh, that's the real demo, guys. Again, if you want to look at it for yourself, 
if you have Rising World and you download it, if you launch it from your desktop shortcut, it will take you into the old version. If you launch it directly from your library, it will give a little pop-up. So watch for the pop-up. Change it. By default, it is the old version. So change it to the uh, demo, and uh, you too will get to walk around. <laughs> so thanks for joining me. I do apologize. Take care of each other, folks, and ciao for now.